Hi. How are we doing? Good to see you all. Uh, hi. Hello, how are we? Wow, chat, look how you've grown. Yeah. And you, Owen, wow. I made some fresh cookies. Yes. Would you like some? I would. Honestly, though, it's lovely to be back. <laughs> we can be like, honestly, though, support. they're pretty bad. <laughs> well, that's the line you were going to take there. <laughs> I was prepared for a later stream. So sorry. Only 25 minutes earlier than the hour that I pushed it back. I always double the amount of time that I'm going to push a stream back. Captions are not on. Captions are not on. One moment. Boop. Good to see you all. Thanks for turning up. Appreciate it. You could have been anywhere and you chose to be here. Thank you. Luan, I've got some ideas of like some TikToks that I think we should film together that I think would be good. Also, didn't manage the update. I'm so lucky I saw that notice. Didn't manage the update. Didn't manage the update. Like what? I'll, I'll explain. I'll explain. But I think we could do some good, some good content. Do, 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 do. I've just been outside. I've just been, I figured I've been in Brighton for the past, what? Four years. And then before that, about 15 years. And I've never, ever stuck my head outside to see what Pride's about. Turns out, uh, capitalism. Turns out that's what it's about. Never knew. Who knew? Who knew? Uh, so, good to know. <laughs> right, yeah. It's good. Do you want a drop-shipped flag? Of course you do. Buy one. £15. Uh, no, it was fun. It was nice. I just sat down with some people on the grass and just went, hello, and generally spoke. It's always a bit odd when you meet somebody who's not a streamer and you get a little insight into like a normal person's life and work schedule. And then there comes a point where they go, so what do you do? How do you know everybody here? And you go, uh, Minecraft. That's how, I, that's how I open it. I've tried the other way. I've tried the, oh, streaming, streaming. And they go, oh, cool, what do you stream? And then I have to go, Minecraft. So better to just pull the Band-Aid off, I think. Just rip it off in one go. Sometimes I go Minecraft roleplay based on the Maze Runner and see if I can like take them off guard a little bit. <laughs> Sometimes I say I uh, roleplay as a little rat, and when then when when the inevitable silence follows, I go just to see if that kind of like you know communicates the vibe. Thank you, RUI underscore zero 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 seven eight for the follow. Luan's got me back on my, on my, you know what? Let's have it back just for today. I'm, I'm, I'm re-enabling the, uh, follow, follow notification. <laughs> doodle doo doo. It's back. Alert box settings. Follower settings. All right. If anybody is currently watching, this is not an invitation to follow, unfollow, and follow. Don't do that. I'll be mad at you if you do that. Slash Jen. I'll probably time you out. If anybody's watching who isn't a follower, please go ahead. It's the angle. That's a long time. <gasps> Wait for it. And thank you on seeing Deeming. I see you there. Oh, it didn't come through. Oh, I didn't save. I didn't save. Dang it. If there's anyone else. <laughs> Thank you all the same, Unseen Demon, for the follow. Appreciate it. That's why, we, that's why we test. That's why we do testing. That's the whole point of the testing. Do we all follow Mr. G? I think, you, I think we've got... A, my statistics are telling me that 100% of people that are currently watching are following. So, good job, everyone. I just opened stream. <laughs> it was good timing. Good timing. I can just emulate it. Just a test. Shall we see? Here we go. Here it is. There it is. It's back. If 
For one day only. My follow cuter. Dang. Yeah, you're right. Flashbacks. Flashbacks. Okay. I gave you so much nostalgia. It was literally just one, one little. Do, do, bill, 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 bill. So we got, what did we get? We got netherite. So we're pretty tanky right now. We're actually the tankiest we'll ever be for the remainder of the series. Because this is a pig where I don't have an elytra. So I'm just kind of constantly be decked out in full netherite prop four. Bow, 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 right down the line. Close enough. Welcome back. 2022. Yeah, why not? Uh, so I think I want to go back into the mines, the netherite mines, and grab a bunch of quartz. Uh, and then we will use that quartz to get ourselves some extra levels. So we can try and get efficiency and silk touch on our pickaxes. Sound like a plan? And during that process, I'll talk to you guys. Be I'll be going to go get some noodles. No worries. Where's my uh, blaster gone? Oh, wait, it's there. Of course, I just don't have my resource pack enabled. One moment. There we go. I was like, where's my blaster? What have you guys been up to today? Oh, I didn't mean to have this continue, but I actually kind of like it. So we will. We'll let it. We'll let it carry on. Oh, three more. Vibing. Nice. Good. Bum, ba, da, bum, bum. Cut my hair somewhat successfully. That's brave. Vibing and reading. Cleaning my house. I just went into town. Do do do. We need some more food. We are actually criminally low on food. Been watching Doc Two and playing games. That sounds like a nice Saturday. Made a mid meal. Made a mid meal. I'm sorry your meal was mid. I'll grab two of these and one of these. No, two of those. I'm trying to make a sword. I feel like I want flame aspect. And I'm going to see if I can just fish it up. Nope. Alright, never mind. Forget that. Sorry, cows. Culling season is here. You don't get to be let out. The sheep do. That was dangerous for me to jump in there. That could have been entity cramming. I kind of guessed that it wouldn't be because there is space. But if I pulled out wheat right now, it could be entity cramming. I know that video. What video? I know that song. Egyptian, Egyptian reggae. Yes, good song. You say, imagine that's how you died. People have died to entity cramming. I believe it was, I forget which hardcore player it was, but he died to entity cramming. There was a creeper hole in the ground in his big cow field. And he, picked, he had a bit of wheat in his hand and he fell into the hole and all the cows piled into the hole with him. Uh, and he didn't have his elytron, and he got entity crammed to death. Bad time. Gotta watch out. Gotta watch out for entity cramming. And that's why I'll never do a piglin farm. <sighs> I probably will at some point, but not for a long while. Okay, now I need to... There we go. Hello, I'm like, who got entity crammed? Just somebody online. Just like a... You're not an enchanter. Don't fool yourself. Can I get... Mm, I'm going to see if I can roll now. No worries, I'll do it for you instead. That way you don't have to... Thank you. Wait, no. Not in my world, surely. <laughs> um, I right, keep your eyes peeled for the books. There's 34 books out there somewhere. There they are. It was 26. I opened the land real quick. If you were nearby to get land and you didn't tell me, I'd be so peeved. I'd be so, so mad. 
Uh, okay, now where's the lapis? There you are. Boop. Are you guys doing anything tomorrow with your, your Sunday? Fortune 3 is really nice to have another one, but I would prefer to have... Um, that silk touch. Perfect. Do, 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 do. Here he is, here he is. The Bruno plushie was successfully backed, by the way. Much appreciated. I know what you want from me, from me. There you go. It's Owen, it's me! Do we have any more diamonds, or is that it? Four. I have enough to make... <laughs> One more pickaxe. Uh, I'm going to disenchant this sword, I think. It's not actually that good. Where did the grindstone go? Did I leave it in here? Did I ever have a grindstone? Oh, it's the, the, <laughs> it's the wheels on the bike. Might meet a friend for a picnic. Nice. Tomorrow's my last full day on vacation, so beach again. I do like beach. I think I'll probably go to the beach tomorrow. If you're in Brighton and you go to the beach, you may see me. Probably not. It's a big beach. Every time my friends have from G Juice Cafe have, have from the, I'm sending the happy birthday. The clapping. wheels nice. on the bike go round and I round. I also thought that when I said it. I don't know what I want on this sword. But I think I'm going to make another pickaxe because uh, Silk Touch is good, but I need it to have other things. I'll go to the beach tomorrow to find you. You should. This is such a good song. Efficiency is not great. What? There's no way. How? That really took me off guard there. Not busy. I swear I have been though. There you go. Well, we need phantom membrane anyway, eventually. Oh my gosh, please. I guess, yeah, it was all the time spent in the never. There's no physical way. <laughs> Shut up. I'll never be free of that, will I? All right, let's sleep away. Sleep. I haven't been AFKing. I haven't been doing really any AFKing. Doo -doo 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 nope. Boo, get better bits. <laughs> I'm breaking's pretty good just to have us on a book, but I don't I have that. Pretty certain I have that. Yeah, I do. You get better bits? Oh, yeah, you got me there. <laughs> okay, check the sword. Check the pickaxe. I think we probably can get a better enchantment on the silk touch for that. Do, 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 do. Simon. Owen. Not Simon. Thanks for the bit. Oh, get better bits. Nice. You did, ma you did attend to sleep in many, many, way too many different beds. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Don't they know that I was trying really hard? Um, okay, we are going down to get a bunch of quartz. And we're going to silk touch it all. Boop, 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 boop. Owen, are we ever getting an inscription cases mod stream? Maybe on my ult? Maybe. It's tricky. I like doing other things that aren't Minecraft, but I also feel like I have a demographic, I have a brand, and I kind of need to, like, stick to it. I don't know, chat. Twitch is in a, in a bit of a lull right now in terms of, like, viewership and stuff. Um, like across the board. I don't like saying that always. I think it takes away a lot of agency from creators when they go, I don't have a golden helmet on. That's what they say. Um, anyway. I think it takes away agency from creators to like 
rethink their strategy and stuff when they go, oh, use a down, blah, 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 whatever. Wow. Okay. The Endermen have been going ham recently. Look at all these block. What? What is going on? Why are they doing this? <laughs> Look how many there are. Dang, they re they're just relocating. Um, anyway, I think it takes away. Oh, ciao. I think it takes away agency from creators when they go like view viewership is down. Um, across the board. That being said, you know, post subathon lull is a thing, and I just feel like I need to like double down and do what I've been doing, why people are here. If I'm building a community and audience, I want it to revolve around hardcore. So I don't think I can like justify doing games that aren't Minecraft right now. Right now. Obviously when Rats comes out, that's gonna be the main thing. So I'm gonna be trying to like do as much of the hardcore branding stuff as possible. Do, do. I definitely think over the years I've become less of a hardcore streamer. At least as I think, I think that's what people think of uh, less of me. Not as in less of me, as in less in value, but as in they think of hardcore of me less than they used to. Uh, and I don't know how to feel about that because it's it is my game mode. It's why it's why I love the most. So I don't know how to take that. You know, maybe I need to like. Push out content that's specifically hardcore themed on TikTok. Hardcore definitely had a booming phase thanks to Filza off in my earlier days. When you said you've been doing variety. When I said you've been doing variety. But I haven't. Like I did it, I do it for the subathon and I do it for Christmas. But because I died in my hardcore world, there was this period where I wasn't doing hardcore for a long time. And then before I knew it, people just didn't like attribute hardcore to me. It's always huge between. I forgot time and... zones were a thing and was like, yeah. why is bro awake at 4 a.m.? Oh, no, it is just for I am in Australia. It is just for it. <laughs> Doop. Do, 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 do. You did. You took before your old world ended and after. Yes. So. Wait, before my old world ended, what was I doing? Why did I stop? I did the, I did the like world, you know, the, um, the end project. And then I took a break. Why? Was it really just for pirates? Did pirates take that long? Dang. I, th I did a lot of coding, didn't I? And I enjoyed the coding. Do I fear I will never go back to data packs when plugins are so much more convenient, but I think I always knew that that would be the case. The command blocks to data packs to plugins to mod development pipeline goes crazy. Uh, it didn't interest, not that it didn't interest me as much, but now that you've seen the finale of the hardcore thing, of hardcore season four, you can tell that my heart was in the end project because it was the culmination of the entire story. Like my whole story plot revolved around it. So when I'd finished it in my head, I was like, hardcore and is dead, quote unquote. Like season four guy jumped into the void. Whether he's dead or not, I don't know. It depends on your interpretation of the story. I, I'm not going to confirm or deny one way or another. But in my mind, I'd made that up. And so then any building that I did in the world after that felt like it was unjustified or like non-permanent. That's probably because I've been mean, doing for like 80% of the time I've watched sheep. Fair. Anyway, you the real ones. The hardcore chatters are the ones that I remember. Huh. Do, 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 do. I know this sounds stupid since it's hardcore, but what happens if you get blepped? Do you just make a new world? Uh, if it happens before I kill the Ender Dragon, I make a new world with the same concept and theming, so it'll be sci fi Owen again. If I die after I kill the Ender Dragon, Sci-Fi Owen's gone, and I've got to come up with something new. By branding, I think, so that's a plus on your front. You've always been an MC player by branding, so I think it's a plus on your front on wanting to continue hardcore. Yes, it's it's convenient, right? That I don't really have a, a want or desire to... I don't think I could do anything that wasn't hardcore. Like, when I think... Obviously, I've got the SMPs and stuff. But when I think Minecraft, I think hardcore. And if it wasn't for hardcore, I don't think I would be a Minecraft streamer. I think I'd be a variety streamer. 
Like my heart still lies in this game mode of the game. I'll do a bit of coding here and there. I'll do a storytelling SMP. But you know, I just don't think, I just don't think I can do anything else. We are so similar, Owen. Lightly, lightly modded. We should collab. No, oh, we should, you're right. I'm not even a fan, but I watch it only really from your view because it's so funny. Oh, God, I'm glad. I'm glad that we can be comedic. Hup. We're just getting experience right now. Getting all this quartz from the mines now that we've gotten all the uh, netherite. I'm very pleased that we got full netherite. I didn't know how long that was going to last. How long that specific stream was going to go on for. But I've got a TikTok editor now, so I think I'm going to push on socials. This has always pulled me back in when drifting away, which is why I'm really uh, happy you're not losing interest. Because as funny as people are, they're never, they're never this constant. It's nice to revisit the world again and again. It being the same world is nice because you, you pick up where you left off over and over. Do we have a stream tomorrow? No stream tomorrow. It's a Sunday. I'm trying to stick again to my more rigid Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday vibe. All days except Wednesday and Sunday. Trying to stick to it. Eh. Uh-oh. No, wait. We broke the curse. It's fine. This song's fine. Copium. This song's fine. It doesn't herald any kind of bad omen. Hup, hup, hup. Uh, let's... Oh, a little bit of quartz for me there. Let's go down the other branch. I think it's this way. Am I going the wrong way? Eat! Hey, Pumpkin, thank you much for the follow. <laughs> I can't believe we're back in this. <laughs> thank you, Pumpkin. Wait, why is it a bad omen? So this is the song that was playing when I lost my first hardcore world. And since then, it has act heralded this sort of bad omen and... It has. It had to be skipped. Uh, every time it came on, and it was sad because I really liked the world. But we then played it on the losing of season two, three, two and three. But when I finished the end project, we played it to to mark the ending of the end project, and that sort of like lifted the curse. This non-existent curse. This curse of this song. Which is good because it's a banger. But it is very emotional. That and... Um, what's the other one? Oh, chat. What's the other one? I need to go look it up. He's got a new release. He's got a new release. I didn't realize he had a new release. Look at the sky. Get your wish. Something comforting, trying to feel alive. Unfold, unfold, which I will queue up now. Unfold is another banger. As I, wa as I watch the one unfold, yes, yes. Oh, it's good. We'll play it in a second. We're also going to queue up uh, his new song, Smile, colon, D. Porter Robbins, I think, is the only... Po not true, not true. I've seen Cody Fry... Cody Fry? I've seen Corey Wong live. I've not seen Cody Fry live. Thank you very much, Brooke. Oh, Brooke. We, oh, man. Brooke made another account. Um, thank you, Brooke, for the follow. Uh, Brooke made a lot of accounts. 1,981 9, of them, it seems. Um, when do you next visit? The, not trying to make sure everything got there safely. Oh, yeah, I should. In fact, oh, man, I passed the post office today. I should, I should go and uh, get it. I'll go and get it tomorrow if it's open. And then in Monday, I'll, I'll, I'll showcase what we got. I also need to find an adapter for this. So I might I might go into Toby's office and ask Way politely if he has an adapter of any kind. I don't think two stacks is going to be enough experience, but let's see anyway. Um, what was I saying? Oh, it's gone. Help me out, chat. Yes, I've seen Corey Wong live. Incredible. I would see Cody Fry live. I would see Porter Robinson live. I don't think I would bother seeing anybody else live. I would see, I would see Ghibli Studios uh, like orchestra live. I don't think I would go see Samurai Live. I really, really like them. Don't get me wrong. But I really just don't like going to concerts. So it has to be something that... It has to be something that I like really, really, really need to see. But Sammy Ray is very, very good. 
I would see Jacob Collie alive. Yeah. We're going to the nether roof today, by the way. Have you seen what she's like? Her clips have such an energy stamp. I bet they do. Only concert I'd go to is alternative radio. That literally will never happen. That is sad. That will never happen. Yes, I bet Stardew Valley musical would be nice. The Stardew Valley Orchestra. Okay, let's grab the food. And make ourselves a pillar. Oh. That's not good. I wonder how that happened. Uh, boop, boop, boop. Blaster. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's make ourselves a pillar. Yeah, it's a bow texture. That's why the skeleton also had one. feels easier to aim with. It is very fun. I like it a lot. I'm just butterfly clicking. I'm, it really isn't that fast in comparison to like what other people can do, but it's fast enough that when building... <gasps> why did I... Why is this song so sentimental? It's the end of one try SMP. It's the end of my Ark of a Phantom SMP. Ark of a Phantom SMP? Ark of a Phantom storyline. It is really good. I remember when Kyle F showed me this song and I was like, wait... I need to do something with this. And it works so well. Man, if I had a penny for every time Porter Robinson made a song about world, I'd have two pennies. Which isn't a lot, but it's weird that it's happened twice. And also really convenient when you play Minecraft and it's all about the worlds that you play on. End of a world and watch the world unfold. Listen to Phantom of the Opera music. Oh, Phantom of the Opera music. Don't, don't tempt me. Oh, missed a bit there. Uh, that was like barely any experience. Turrets, nickels, not pennies. I'm English. <laughs> so it's going to be pennies. Why would I get nickels? Oh, I know because my stupid pickaxe ate it all, didn't it? Look at it all, it's so greedy, it's so greedy. I was like, why is, why did I not go up a single level from that entire pillar? It's fine, it serves me right for mining netherrack with a fortune pick. Such a bang of a song. I think I'd cry if I heard this live. Hey, hello. Is there any like ores I can smell up? A little bit? Not a lot. Here's me talking to myself. This is this song is your soulmate. True. Have you played RL Craft? Yeah, I didn't really like it. I really like challenging. I really, really, really like challenging media. I'm a glutton for punishment when it comes to certain video games, as seen by my Darkest Dungeons uh, obsession. 
But R.L. Craft doesn't follow good You're game design. You're talking about these songs having some link to do with worlds of yours, while the reason I personally get so emotional, and I know Lita too, is cause both you've played at the end of a Sabathon. Goodbye to a world at the first one two years ago, this one on last year's one. Dang. That's crazy. What did I play this year? I don't think I played anything this year, did I? It was purposely made to to be to not make sense. Uh oh great. Then why is it so popular? I could very easily make something that is both punishing. It takes a very good game designer to make something that is both punishing and rewarding as seen by <laughs> Darkest Dungeon. But anybody can throw together like the most nonsensical mod mods and be like, "There you go." I would much prefer somebody make a I think uh the Fear Nightfall is a really good, challenging, but rewarding, uh, really good, challenging, but rewarding mod pack. I guess it was just supposed to be hard. Yeah, I don't know. And it's not for me. I played it and it didn't teach me. And it didn't like lead by design. So I was like, okay, I guess I'll just leave. You'd think it'd be right up my alley, but unfortunately not. We'll do more Fear Nightfall. It's it's gone. We've done a lot on the Fear Nightfall world. It's been sick. Anyway, what what did I play? I sorry, I missed anybody that said anything about what I played at the very last bit. Um Oh, this is his new song. I thought you passed away in game for a second. I got so confused how a skeleton killed you. How do you mean? Goodbye to a world. Makes sense. I think I can take a left here. Okay. It's... It's a whole album? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten songs? Rewind. How am I only finding about this now? This is criminal. It came out a week ago. This is dreadful. How dare you all let me miss this? <laughs> Another skeleton heard noise in my brain that meant you passed away. Oh, I see. This one's not for me personally, but I like the little... I like... I really, really, really like when Porter Robinson did more s synthetic alteration on his own voice. He's become more comfortable in his natural voice, which is great because he is good. But I think what made him, like, really, really stand out was how he, like, sung as both masculine and feminine using, like, uh, vocaloid settings on his own voice. Uh, maybe it's the vocaloid fanboy in me. Unfold has that, you know? Unfold has that vocaloid vibe. I mean, if we go back one song... Oh, dang, I missed it. Where is it? Why do I not have unfold to hand, like just ready? It's me, Orange TV. Like this is Porter Robinson's voice. Uh, no. Do 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 do. It's it's oh, it's so good. Don't be weird, Johnny. Don't be weird. The mods will get you. They're looking for an excuse already. Anyway. That's strike two, Johnny. You're on strike two. Don't do it. Don't do it. That's two. <laughs> Dude. 
I'll let them put. What does that what does that mean? I'll let them put. Do 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 do. There it is. <laughs> I was waiting. They'll sit in timeout for ten. Do, 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 do. You can just get a vibe. Thank you for the time out there, of course. We tag teamed. Do, 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 do. Uh, I've been I've been playing this game for too long to know. To not know even. Dun dun do 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 Okay. Banger Cheerleader is, was his single release before he released this album. And this is when I was like, okay, I think that this album he's about to release has legs. I think this is gonna go this is gonna this is gonna bang. A little bit a little bit of synth on the voice, like I was saying, goes a long way. It's a certain style. It's not because he has a bad singing voice. He's a very good singing voice, much better than mine. But it's just unique. It's unique and fun. Do 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 do. I'm very excited for rats. I'm very excited for you guys to see my new character. I think we're going to do a Q&A on the Patreon. I'm so sorry that there hasn't been much content on the Patreon. We've, we've got something, we've got two big things planned for the Patreon. But the problem is we can't talk about it. Because it will, we can't risk people on the Patreon leaking it to the non-Patrons. So it has to be like, we have to be ready to announce it fully. But we've got some like, event style things happening on the Patreon. And then we've got something to do with rats happening for the Patreon members as well. Will you have a tail? I will have a tail. In fact, having a tail is a big part of, of my character's backstory, funnily enough. He uses his tail a lot. Do, 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 do. I think that's the first big thing I've said about my character. Do, do, do. Tell me, maybe, maybe. We've got to get to, we've got to, get to concept arting, Luan. Jungle rat swinging through the trees with his tail. He's actually a possum. <laughs> oh, chat, bless. It was so. Uh, it was so. <laughs> such a shame. Uh, what was it? Eloise said said in in season one. Can I be a mouse? And we went no. So sorry. Um, and, and we were asked routinely throughout the months leading up to Rats 1, can I be a mouse though? Can I, can I just be a mouse pretending to be a rat? Um, and we never let it happen. I had to put my foot down and say, sorry, this can't happen. We had, uh, we had a, a new person come in to the cast recently and went... Uh, can, can I, what's the deal with being a rat? Do you have to be a rat? Or can, can, can I be a mouse? And then this isn't me dobbing Apo in, because I love Apo dearly, but Apo was like, we'll consider it. And I <laughs> had to take Apo to the side and be like, no, we, no, we won't. No, we can't. We'll get crucified. If we, if we let this newcomer in and let them be a mouse, Eloise will turn up to my house with a with a knife and be like, "What's the deal with this, Owen?" So no, I'm afraid not. I think I was one of the main people gunning for the whole only rat situation in season one. So I think Apo just forgot that like that situation and and where I kind of like drew the line in the sand. So I, th I think she was just like, "Yeah, well maybe we'll see." 
Do do do. Mouse SMB next. It's been very interesting watching like um how Apples and I's writing affects the space. Because we see ripples where we go. Like post outsiders, we saw a lot of outsiders related things. Post rats, we saw a lot of um people being smaller than the average size of like player related things. I haven't seen much to do with like pirates related stuff. I think that's more because it wasn't like as crazy pushing the boat out, no pun intended, as um, as it could have been. Like we did a lot of stuff of it and we really challenged the norms. But you know, when you hear pirates, you can have a pretty good idea on what it's going to mean. I've got another project lined up for us in 2025, like summertime, uh, which I think will challenge the way that people think about SMPs a little bit, which I'm excited to do. It's been cooking for about a year now. <sighs> aliens, aliens SMP and space SMP and that kind of thing is just too big scope. No Man's Sky really kind of hit this. The great thing about rats is it was very easy to make it feel full because the world was so small. But space is so big. It was the same situation that we had with pirates where we had like the whole ocean and then we had to make an entire ocean's worth of content. And that was really tricky for us to do and also cost a lot of money. So I think if we did like a, I think if we did like a space related thing, it would be really tricky for us to make it feel lived in, populated, alive. One of the main complaints of No Man's Sky in its early days was that it just didn't feel like there was anything to do. People just like would go down onto the... What was that lyric? Sorry, what? Oh, this is definitely explicit. Pitchfork reviews, they're calling me their big words, the big new thing. Oh, YouTube review, funny monkey took a pee into his own mouth, crazy. What? Why, why are you singing that? <laughs> I forgot that we were like doing a review. Well, this is explicit. I'm going to take family friendly off because the next, this song and the next two songs are explicit. I don't know why. Probably because he said P. We didn't say P, he said something else. Random word generator. <laughs> Let's see, I guess. Anyway, it would be very tricky to do a... Um, you could recreate the game, game Grounded. I, I think that would just be... I think like an insect SMP would be kind of fun. But then I think it's almost too small. To the point where chisel and bits is like big. That's just rats again. Yeah. I think it would be cool to do like you're even smaller, but one I think we would people would be like, okay, do they not have any new ideas? Uh, and also I think it we would struggle to make the de rats, you're the perfect size as a rat. Small enough that the world feels big, but big enough that there can still be small things in your hands. I'm a new idea lover as well. I don't like doing repeats. Rats was a... Oh, that's a rude word. Uh, rats was an exception to the rule. And it's probably why I would never do a Pirates again. And if I did, it would be in like years to come. I think we let a good amount of time cook. Like a year and a half. Two years, actually. Two years between the start of each SMP. I think that's a good amount of time. That's like just long enough where people can't say you're like we... Hashing the same trope. Sydney, thank you much for the sub. In the seven months. Right, we've got a full pickaxe. Now we're actually going to start getting some XP. Let's do this. Okay, let's grab this and this and this and this. Cool. Also, yeah, people were like really really wanting rats too people are wanting cowboy smp with what time i say 
Like, how, am, how do I, how can I ever get the time to do that? It crossed my mind a couple of times. I won't lie. I was like, well, this is fun media. But me and what, what are me, you know? Will it be a whole new story? A whole new story. A whole new story. How can I sway you? We'll see. We'll see. I got big things. I got a lot of stuff towards the end of this year. I got some event stuff coming up. I've got some, I've got rats. We wanted to do two one shots before rats happened. Nope. It's a bit at this point. It really is, isn't it? This is going to be the first time that... Oh, yeah, I've, I can say now. I'm running a panel at San Diego. I'm, I'm the host for the panel. This is going to be the first panel we've ever run where we haven't gone. And there's something happening. Way! You know? Because we announced pirates and then we announced rats. And what am I going to, what am I going to announce? I'm going to be like... Uh, rats is still about to happen. <laughs> okay, this just feels like rave music. I feel like I'm about to lean over to my friend and be like, You wanna go home? What? Home? Home? We can, we can go. We can get the we can get the Victoria to leave now. I don't know what's happening right now. I don't know why. I don't know why we're doing techno, techno rave. So I didn't hear you. Could you repeat that, please? That was the end of the song. Oh. Okay, that was interesting. Next one. This one's called Perfect Pinterest Garden. It's sparkling. I get you. So I couldn't hear you. Gosh, you made me want to go to a loud concert again. Mm -mm. Hi, hello. How's it going? It's Kizma. Kiz Kim Kiz Kim <laughs> I'm glad he's still making music. I can tell he's getting a little bit freaked out by the fame. A lot of these lyrics are about like, do I sell myself? People think I'm in, I'm the next big thing. I think every artist probably has that moment where they're like, okay, this has gotten bigger than I expected. But I can hardly keep my eyes open. Get some rest, Ravel. It's fine. You're all good. Hey, Pandia. Is Pandia here? Hello, Pandia. Oh, well, that's a... Okay, we might hit 30 levels here. Oh, no. Am I? Maybe, actually. Oh, it could... Oh, hang on. There you go. Sick. All right. Do you have the MCC cape? No, not yet. I still need to go do it. I think I have like two days left or something. Um, right. So what's the best way to do this? I can get silk touch. I want efficiency on this pick. That's what I'm going for. But until I get efficiency... Density, you. Uh, until I get efficiency on the book, I don't think I can do it. I think I'm just going to try and roll for a really good set. If this, if this is, I forgot about that. What? I need to lock in. Thank you very much. It's natural for the follow. Oh, you, oh, you need to get the thing. Yes. You need to get it. Uh, okay. I'm really, really hoping that this is at least got efficiency on it so I can add I'm breaking myself. Minecraft, you spoil me. Stop it. Stop it. Everyone knows. I'm... Everyone's going to know I'm your favorite. Sick. All right, that was easy. Let's throw this into the, uh, the motorbike wheel. Never punished. Okay, can I get efficiency? Loyalty, fortune... Fortune again. Not really. Okay, let's roll until we get some efficiency on these. Oh, I should be rolling on this as well. A 
and efficiency two ew Interesting. The lag spikes are bad? Oh dear. Hey, did you get a beacon yet? Be honest. We're getting netherite on our tools. Hi, Michaela. Michaela, we should hang out sometime. <laughs> um, I'd be fun. I think that would be fun. I think that would be fun. I feel like we get, I feel like we would get along if we hung out. But you won't give, you won't, you won't give me like a social chance, you know? You keep egoing me. <laughs> I don't know what this bit is. <laughs> like, people think, like, oh, they hung out today, but we literally went to the cafe, we ordered our drinks, they served the drink to you, you took the photo, and then you got up and left. Yeah, I only hang out with people active on Instagram. Dang it. Okay, I need another seven levels, chat, to get efficiency, so that we can get efficiency five, so we can get the perfect pick. So you know what that means, back into the mines. <laughs> Sorry that we keep doing a bunch of quartz mining, chat. I know it's probably not the most exciting thing for you. I can't believe that the seeds in my latte and not yours. Chat, we both ordered lavender lattes today. Uh, which are really nice, by the way. I do still have a pillar to finish. I guess I should go do that. I'll do it when I get back. Um, and uh, as they serve mine, they serve mine first. Michaela goes, oh good, they're not doing the seeds anymore. I forgot to ask for no seeds and they didn't put any seeds in yours. That's good. Because they put like lavender seeds. And I go, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> About 14 seconds later, they, they serve Michaela's lavender latte. It's got lavender seeds in it. <laughs> and I just gave, I gave it like this. <laughs> and it was just, thank you. <laughs> The way <laughs> oh dear. If I'd ordered an oat latte one, we could have just swapped. It's a rough time. Did he say and help me was when I, what I meant to say as I gnashed my teeth right in front of you. Okay, I thought you said smashed his teeth right, teeth right in front of him. I was like, excuse me? What's going on? Uh, okay, is there any more quartz in these mines? I think I've probably picked it clean. Oh, no, that's bedrock. I think I've picked this clean. Yo, thank you much, Clark, for the follow. Much appreciated. Are you analyzing these lyrics? Would you, excuse me? Of course. Aren't you proud of me? Isn't that what you do? Oh, three, one. All right, let's, let's shift into the next one. That wasn't a question. You fool. Oh, you are analyzing these lyrics. Oh, I see. Yeah, of course I would. St I'm so stupid. She's gonna laugh at me for the rest of the day. I'm so stupid. Okay, he's grabbing that bit of gravel. Okay. Boop. This song sounds like AI written. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'm not gonna like will Porter Robinson to have different lyrics because the lyrics that he wrote that are the songs where I'm like, I feel the most attachment is when he had like a loved one who was in hospital and was like going through um, some pretty heavy medical treatment. So I'm not gonna be like, go back to the old style of writing. It's like, okay, no, actually, I'm glad that you are instead writing about fame rather than uh, eating through a tube kind of thing. It's kind of sad. It is sad. It is sad. That's why it hits so hard, I think. Because he's been inspired by me. Yeah. Wait, follow us on. Or am I gaslighting myself? Yeah. I was inspired. Full credit to Lementine, guys. I found this small stream and I thought, this is a cool idea. You like thank the people that follow you. 
I'm gonna take that. That's my idea now. So that's the vibe now. Is Partner still alive? I don't know. I haven't read enough about it. Small streamer? I'll strangle you. <laughs> Literally, we're about one year away from Luan averaging more than me. And that's when I quit and become your full-time manager. The ultimate power play. <laughs> and I've been saying. <laughs> Oh, huge. <laughs> if you've got a cry. Oh, no, don't. Don't say that. No, I've I've told people when I said I was going to put on the follow notif that I'll get actually peeved. Family friendly peeved. Family friendly peeved. You know, you all know what I'm saying when I say peeved. That's what I mean when I say if you're going to if you're going to do that for the bit. Bad, bad bit, bad new get new bit. Bad bit, bad you. You always peeved at me? Not true, not true. You just say that to make yourself feel better when I actually am peeved at you. Oh, I know what you mean. That's right, I'm hecked off. I'm I'm fuming. I'm losing my socks right now. Oh, Alex, thank you so much for the follow. Absolutely raging I am. I'm really bubbling in my kettle. <laughs> That's a silly one. There is no physical way. Ha ha ha. That's really interesting. The lyric just said, I can't get the tea. I got my like teeth fixed and I regret it so much like that. I can't get the teeth that my mum gave me back. That's kind of sad. That's cool though. I hadn't really ever considered that. It's a funny bit to be stuck on, known for. I'm glad you think so. That's kind of nice. Do you think this is because he smashed them earlier? No. Yeah, if we had a penny, nickel, sorry, <laughs> for every time, sorry, I'm, I'm kidding. Every time we heard teeth in this album. I remember, I, in, in comparison to others, you got to admit, I, I remember I was in a, um, I think I've told this story before. I was in a meeting for my church when I was a youth minister and that we were talking about how like, other youth groups are doing and that kind of thing and like just sort of getting a vibe for the area and and they were like you know do you know if the other youth are going to uh like different youth groups are we getting the ones that are like local to our area and i was like maybe but to be honest like comparison is the thief of joy so i try not to think about that too much and everyone was like wow owen that was really insightful and i was like oh thanks <laughs> and then like a couple of minutes later, my boss circled back to me and was like, that's a really moving thing to say, Owen. And I was like, just so you're aware, I didn't come up with that. And they were like, oh, okay, never mind. Immediately lost interest. They're like, oh, okay. Yeah. As if, as if because I didn't come up with it, it didn't like hold weight. Crazy. Could have gotten a raise. <laughs> That's the end of that. Is there another line? Mm, I don't think so. I don't know if there's going to be enough. We do have the stuff back at home. I don't know how I managed to just run past a whole a whole line of it on the walls. I must have just like been zeroed in. Oh, I feel like I haven't been down this mine. Let me keep going real quick. By comparing you to the original <laughs> daughter. Hi, I'm new here. Wrong, incorrect, lies. You're a liar and a thief and a scoundrel. I'm 
trying to think of other stories from the time I worked for a church. I don't really have many, I'll be honest. Nothing really like stood out crazy amounts. It was a pretty like, I just sort of stuck in my own lane. I'm a psych student at NYU and doing a server and streaming. If you don't mind, can I have your stream key? Yeah, absolutely. It's 447 447 447 447. Don't you want a normal church experience? Yeah, but you know, it's kind of fun to leave with stories sometimes. One time in the winter, the uh, I lived connected to the church, like in the house that was attached to the church. Um, you were called Hugs for Olive. Oh my gosh, I remember that. Uh, can you confirm this again? No, sorry. <laughs> I, I only once, I've forgotten it. Um... Yeah, I lived in the house attached to the church hall. And at one point, the fire alarm went off. And I was like, give me a sec. And I went into the kitchen where the fire alarm was going off. And uh, there was just water just pouring from the ceiling. An, an, an unprecedented amount of water. And it was soaking down into the office below. Uh, and I had to call the vicar being like, hey, uh, something bad's happening. Uh, please make your way over here as soon as you can. And we just sort of like looked at it, trying to figure out how to stop it. Turned out the um, the boiler in the attic had frozen because it was winter and the pipe, the, the pipe had burst because it had frozen and all of the water was like draining out into the... And then it was like dripping into the office below. It was bad. It was a bad sight. I'm trying to see if I can find it. Because, of course, your boy took a photo video. I just want to make sure that there's no, like, any way for you to see what church it was. Because we don't need that. Uh, no. Hold on. What does that sign say? Nope. It just says, please do not leave the fridge unlocked. Man, if only I knew back then that I would eventually be showing it. Okay. Classic winter move. Classic winter move. Here you go. I'll turn the sound on. No sound? Sound. Thank you very much, Queen, for the uh, for the follow. Here you go, chat. I was not kidding. Look at this. The water had grown so deep that you could see reflections on the floor. This much water on the floor. So uh, that cost a lot to get repaired. It was so much that it was like a curtain of water. Free shower. Yeah, as if the buckets were really doing anything. I had to call my brother-in-law, who was a plumber, being like, I need you to tell me how to stop water from entering anywhere in the building now. And he was like, okay, go to this panel. It'll probably be in the, like, public loo area. And I was like, okay. And I ran in. And he was like, okay, um, you need to look for, like, a valve. It'll be, like, this color. And uh, you need to turn it off. And I was like... There's a panel. And he was like, yeah, it's in the panel. And I'm like, the panel is screwed shut. Like, there's wood over the panel. And he went, right, you need to get into that panel. And I was like, okay. So then I had to run back to my, my flat, grab a screwdriver, go back, undo four screws, call him back and be like, okay, now what? And he's like, turn these two levers and then turn this one and it should stop. And I did it and I was like, it hasn't stopped. And he's like, yeah, that's because you've stopped all the water from going in. But there's still water in the pipes that has to make its way through. So it will just continue for a bit. And I was like, oh, dang. Okay, cool. We had to make it, take it out for a good 48 hours. Yeah. So then we had, then I had to run down into the office because it was dripping all over all the computers. 
And there was just a fun little bobbing electrical extension just in the, in the, the like this much water. And I was like, now I've taken first aid training and I'm pretty certain that it says to before getting involved in a situation that you should assess whether or not there is A, fire, B, water. If there is water, then C, electricity, question mark. So then before entering the office, I had to go into the uh, downstairs basement and find the fuse box. And then thank you very much, uh, Bale, for the, for the follow. And I had to turn off everything. Just like, do, 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 just turn the whole fuse box off. Then I entered the office being like, man, I really hope I don't get electrocuted right now. Um, and start pulling out like the computers, just ripping the cords out the back of them, lifting these computers and walking them outside so that we could like salvage whatever they were. Yeah, sad for me who didn't think to do that. But you know, fun times, great time, love that. Or did they survive? Yes, they did. But other than that, I didn't have any problems while I worked for the church. There wasn't any like crazy things that happened. Whoa, hello there. No one got like crazy injured. When I was a youth member, people got injured all the time because we would go to like weekend aways and the lads would do like, I don't know, mosh pits or one of them, we would be like playing manhunt in the dark and one of them would run into a goalpost and split his lip open because it was dark and couldn't see where he was going thankfully that never happened when i was a youth minister it was only happened when i was like a youth member bad time bad time that's why man least favorite part about that job safety risks blooming having to do thank you very much by the way hannah for the for the follow um having to do <sighs> Safety briefs. I had to make a spreadsheet for everything. I forget what the exact name of them was called. Safety assessments. Something like that. Everything had to be, what was the safety risk? What could happen as a result? What is the severity of the risk if it happened? What's the likelihood of it happening? And how am I mitigating it? So it would be like, risk, allege, like a, a wire going across the room when we're watching a movie or risk assessments. Thank you. Um, what is the wire? Like the wire going across the room could trip somebody. What would happen? They'd trip and hurt themselves. How likely is it to happen? Relatively likely. How dangerous is it if it were to happen? Medium to low? What are you doing to mitigate it? Taping the lead down so that you can't trip over it. That for everything. Burning, choke hazards, food, knives, electrical hazards, fire, tripping. People getting lost. It was so boring. I had to get risk assessments and then I had to get my bosses to like food. If food was there, oh, it got long. God forbid that we were, no pun intended. God forbid that we were doing our own cooking. If it was like, we're doing cooking. I'm going to give you guys a bunch of ingredients that I bought from the store. Thank you very much, Sweden guy for the follow. I'm going to give you guys a bunch of ingredients that I bought from the store and you have one hour to cook a meal. And then we have judges, you know, like recipe for disaster, but um, they only get what I get give them rather than us choosing what we do ahead of time. If we were doing that, oil, fire, burning, frying, toaster, knives, everything. And then I had to get my boss to sign off on it and he would look at every single thing and he'd go, are you sure that this is going to be enough? Are you sure that this will stop this? And I'm like, yeah. But also, probably not. I don't really care. I just want to. I just want to cook. Let me cook, bro. <laughs> it's a lot. Anybody who's worked in that kind of area of life knows it's it's a lot. And what's funny is that um, I then went and joined Twitch, and I was like, "Cool, I can leave that part. That kind of organization. We don't have a Tuesday stream. Why don't we have a Tuesday stream? What's happening?" Remind me. Now you know what to do in every situation for these. Yeah. You went to London on Tuesday? Oh, I see. 
No, probably not. Probably not on stream tomorrow, but we'll, we'll just stick to how we are. I know I went to London on Tuesday. I'm sorry. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, I then went to Twitch and I was like, I don't have to do that anymore. Uh, and then I saw it in the most unlikely of places again from the other side when, uh, for Tom's video, when uh, there was like the Tubbo wedding. Um, Tom's producer had to like have a form, which was like all, it was a safety assessment. It was all the likelihood, like slipping on ice or something else happening, you know, choking on the wedding cake. And I was like, dang, I've been, I've lived this life. Do -do -do. Okay, I think that's everything. I don't think there's any more. Never mind. It was a fun vid. That was a fun video. I've been replaced now, chat. Replaced in the uh, the demographic of guy who wears dress in Tommy's videos. Average Harry wears them better. Because when I wear them, it was just like, oh, okay, we're just we're just unironically giving Owen an opportunity to serve. <laughs> he's 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 embracing this too much. He's not making it quirky and silly. He's just, he's just wearing the dress. Had to, hate to do it to them, you know. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I pulled it off too much. <laughs> That's so silly. I missed the Bruno allegations. Ah, oh, what, a, what a time that was, eh? All right, we've officially picked this place clean. The weird question. No one saw the dress photos. I hope, I hope they approved. I missed when I didn't know and I only knew him as the Bruno tag guy. The Bruno bag guy. Why would you do that? Why would you say that to me? Oh, do you, Owen? <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> Should we say thanks? Thanks, Olive, Mum. On ice and heels as as well, right? I did run. I got a good. I got a good few strides. I actually ran further, I feel, than the video really showed. But I, I, I tripped. I didn't trip. The uh, I buckled. Cause it's tricky. It's a tricky thing to do. But cool, blimey, that, that was cold. And more and more on my... Oh my God. That's crazy. I love having a uh, feather falling now. Like that. He's ironically posed. <laughs> I'm glad you have it. I can't wait for you to have it. You're going to love it. It's sick. First impression of you was it's the cocoa bean guy. I mix up your name of. You mix me up with Oweka. Dang. Thanks, Cal, for the follow. I don't need it. I'm a clutch queen. It's easier to clutch when you're not on hardcore. You don't have to worry about missing. I joke, I know, I know. Can keep track, it's crazy. Okay, we're really manifesting that we get enough for a um what's it called? Third a level thirty here. Hi Candy. Why must just be our name mum, Stevie Mum, Olive Mum, Leader Mum. That is kinda of funny, isn't it? I got to meet Leader Mum. What a day. I met, me, Leader Mum didn't meet me. I met Leader Mum. Doop, doop, doop. I 
Okay, I think we're high enough to be able to get some fortune going. Manifest chat. I think you should. I think we should get it. Looking at how fast that's going up. Do we loop? Really? We must have. Okay, nothing really stood out to me towards the end there. I'll try this. This is a freestyle, apparently. No, I really can't. I can't get on board of it. I tried, but just saying Kitsune Mison just again and again is not really gonna, it's not gonna cut it for me. It's not gonna cut it, so sorry. Let's have... Um, bup, bup, bup. I think I have something here. What's this that I have in my back pocket? Okay, let's have family friendly tag back on. Chat playlist, maybe? We had that yesterday. You're getting greedy now. Yeah, I think cheerleader, I think they led with their best one. I think, uh, Nurture is still my favorite. Is one record on the last board? I don't know if that's intentional, but you don't have it separated. Do I? I've been doing that more recently, accidentally. The sub upon really mess things up. No, Spotify's going through the music channel. Sort settings. Stream, output. Show me the ways that you can't. All the ways that you want. Send it to the do 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 Where's my pen? Audio. Luanne can show me how to isolate it again, seeing as she's now a pro at it. Do 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 do. We solve the lurk command. Uh huh. How's that? Uh, I always thought it was ribs, but no, it's a sailor jacket. Peak silly guy energy. I'll tell you what. I'm going to call that stream. I'm going to go back into Sorry OBS. if I interrupt, but I'd like to apologize to chat. I do get called away from stream a lot for short periods of time and then come back quite frequently and a lot of lovely people are consistently like welcome back a yarn. And I'm like thank you. But then I keep leaving and returning and they do it like 20 times per stream. I'm very sorry everyone. And thank you lots for being such a welcoming community Aww. OGTV support. Thank you, Moon, for the follow. Of course, Ayan. Ayan? Doesn't matter. It's one of those two. Okay. We got it close enough. Alrighty. So, we are manifesting just efficiency four on this, really, I'll be honest. I don't want anything else. Sick. <laughs> that means we can go over to this guy right here. Combine these two for six, giving us efficiency five. Thank you, Miss Mouse. Never punish, chat. Which gives us our first proper fortune pick, which means we can now go over here with our efficiency five. Smack this guy in. Bup, bup. Hello? Oh, I need a template. Yeah, whoopsie. Boop, boop, boop. First word would always be taken as the username. It had to be a sender instead of user because the user can be changed to available given directly. Oh, cool. I guess I'll change it. Bup, bup, bup. Okay. There it is. We just need mending and efficiency on this silk touch. 
But there's our first, our first netherite tool, chat. That's what we were gunning for. Do do do. Miss Mouse, thanks for the sub. Man, follow and then sub. That's crazy. What a pipeline. Uh, okay. So. It is time. We have about... 30, 40 minutes for us to get to the ne nether roof, the roof of the nether. I've got a zippo and an obsidian stack or so, which is what we need to, in order to get back from the nether. Uh, we need some ender pearls. Could anyone be so, so lovely and let me know what level I need to go to in order to throw a... You know what? No. We're going to practice this on creative again. We always do it on creative once beforehand. Execute in the air, the nether. Run TP owns use to zero one hundred zero. You got to go somewhere? Why only until then? I have got to do... Uh, a meeting for some big stuff that's happening. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's funny. Oh, it was a farm. That's cool. How quick is how quick is this farm? I forgot I made this. Is it fast? Um, remove this. Oops. Oh, cool. <laughs> That's really efficient. Um, okay. Looks like I need to be stood on my heart of hearts. One, two, five. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can do that. One, two, two. One, two, three. One, two, four. Hmm. There's there, but I can't get in there. If I could get to that bit, I could get in. Dude. Oh, there we go. No, no, no. I would need a trap door. I don't want to get myself stuck. I mean, wait, it doesn't matter. This is a creative one. Let's just assume that that was broken. Okay. Okay, one, two, five. Then I would go like this. And then I would go up. That easy. All right, let's go do that. Do, 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 do. Ba, do, 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 do. Okay. That easy. <laughs> that is that's that easy, chat. It's that easy. Ignore me getting a bunch of uh, golden oranges. It's it's that easy. Nothing will go wrong. It's that easy. Surely first try. Well, hopefully, otherwise we die. <laughs> yes, yes, hello. Ah, one moment. Thank you. We should be sleeping. This is silly. Okay. 
No, we won't lose season five because if we haven't, I've got like a light beam stuck out of me there. Uh, we won't lose season five because I'll just do a new world. Mm, 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 Oh, there it is, still there. Ooh. I don't know what I was doing when I came Twitch until until now. Well, thank you for subbing. I appreciate it. Do 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 do. All right, let's. We got twenty. Let's make sure we don't get jumped. Okay, cool. We've got to go up to 125. We're going to take this little avenue here. <laughs> I clearly had the same idea for going down. So let's use it going up. So we're going to the nether roof, by the way, for anybody who's wondering, because we need to have a flat surface where we can kill the wither. And so after I've done this, next stream will probably be trying to get whoopsie daisy. He'll be trying to get some whoopsie daisy. Uh, I should probably have one of these in my hotbar. Uh, it'll probably be killing wither skeletons. Do, do. Oh, that wasn't enough. Oh, you jump! <laughs> that, that, was, that was assault, that was. You tried to push me into the light. There's two of them! Get down from there. That was crazy. Whoa! Alright, bad spot. Is there just like a pool of lava up here? Yep. Okay, we won't go up that way, I guess. How odd. I've never seen one in the roof before. Okay, I really don't like the, like, pushing mechanic <laughs> when it's Enderman in the nether. Me when the nether has lava. Stop it. Just took me off guard is all. Surely there won't be any this way, right? Digging up in the nether is such a bad idea. Digging down in the nether, in the overworld, bad idea. Digging up in the nether. So, yes, nether. Nether world? Do. <laughs> You just never dig anywhere. <laughs> oh, I hadn't considered that. Yeah, good idea. Okay, we're about 20 blocks off. Uh-oh, we're technically going north right now. Which is not good. Because that's up towards where the Aegis crashed. So when we come back out on the other side, we'll be further north, which is close towards the radioactivity. So I might need to get onto the roof and then go back on myself. Um, okay, I need one, two, five. I need to be stood on one, two, five. So we're looking for a dip in the, there we go. That'll do it. Hang on. We might have found it. That was quick. One, two, four. Dang it. Oh, here we go. One, two, one, two, four. One, two, four. Dang it. Videoactivity killed the radioactivity stuff. <laughs> radioactivity. That's so stupid. <laughs> Oh, that is, that's it there, chat. I need, <laughs> if I stood on 
that block, one, two, that would be one, two, five, but I can't get there unless I had a trap door and I don't want to bother. I don't want to risk using a trap door in case something goes wrong. That would also work. Wither skeletons are the worst, you're right. Do you? Do you, Michaela? That's crazy, I don't. Sure hope they're, sure hope they're not listening. They wouldn't know, they wouldn't be lurking. Hey, Christina. What do you mean by that? Oh, hey, we were just talking about you. Oh, my day's been made. That's crazy, that's crazy. There's no way that you are just both in a VC right now, right? That would be crazy. You wouldn't do that. Oh, we found it. I'd never do that. I would never get in a VC. Just, just point blank, I wouldn't get in a VC. All right, manifest good things, chat. We have obsidian and a zippo. That's all we need. There goes my chances. I think I just look here. Okay, great. Is that easy? Cool. I should have used a torch to mark where I came up, but I think it was around about there. So I'll do this. Um, Okie dokie. Let's go south this way. We'll do that for maybe like, let's go to like 1.30. Grab some of these. All right, 1.30, what am I talking about? Let's go to 40, 40.40. 40, stable. I think only English people are gonna actually be on board with that reference. I've, Americans probably call it something different. Do you have opportunity to get back? Can you imagine if I didn't? That'd be bad. One forty, one forty. No, forty, forty. Not one forty, one forty. Um. Okay. I think we're good to go. Let's go back through. See where this takes us. Please don't be underground. Please don't be underground. It's underground. Yippee! How convenient. Okay, grab the coordinates for that, please. 335 minus 41, 308. We're deep as well. We're deep underground. I wouldn't be in a cave this side of my size of my own accord. Okay. I don't like this ambient sound that Kiltro is playing. Okay, we're safe. Let's go. Why Why exactly are we doing what we're doing? So we needed a uh, nether roof portal, which granted is a sucky one. But it's fine. That was probably not the way to link those portals, but I can just do a better job at it later. Do, 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 do. Oh, ooh. That's why, ooh. Always good to check out the caves, at least. It was so crazy watching Luan do a bunch of, like, cave diving jumping into all the caves and stuff and picking it clean of ores. So just like carefree. I was like, dang, I wish I, I, wish I could do that. <laughs> like she's playing on hard mode. So she's technically playing on hardcore because she hasn't died yet. But I can't risk it. Boop. 
such a pro gamer. Oh, thanks. I'm a gamer. They do say. I hear they say I am a gamer. They do. They do. I've been saying it. Everybody's been saying it. Everybody's saying Lemon Time is a gamer. I've, be, I've known she's been a gamer before everybody else. I said to her, I knew her. I knew her a few years ago. I said, you should be a gamer. And, and she is. It's true, I'm they. Nice to meet you, they. You said Zippo earlier, which reminded me of my dad's favorite joke. What's the difference between a hippo and a Zippo? One's really heavy and, and one's a just little a little lighter. lighter. DD. Yeah. Banger. Very good. I used to do Zippo tricks. <laughs> There's a little bit of lore for you. <laughs> As if it was a lighter, it looks like this chat. Now, now we have to. Now, now we have to. Sorry, sorry, I don't make the rules. Actually, change of plans. I think I've shown you already recently. I'm pretty certain I showed you during the subathon, didn't I? Because we took out the big box of stuff. Didn't we? No? You never saw it? Obviously, there's no oil in this one. Not on day five or later, I see. I never saw Zippo tricks. That's all of them, to be honest. What's the ones that I've made? I did this one a lot. I changed it to be like that. I did this one. No, what? how did it go? How did it go? That was a classic. That was it, that was it. And then you'd strike it as you did that. Um, obviously don't play with lighters chat unless you are of the suitable age, but I'm pretty certain I have a video of me. Let me just look it up. This tab just in case. Yes. <laughs> um, okay. I'm just going to like download this video, I think. This was 11 years ago, so I would have been 15. Little guy, it's little me. You're about to see little me. I mean, I was 18. Uh, <laughs> I was 18 when I did this. Dude, what's up? Uh, one moment. I'm just going to get, uh, the math makes sense. Math, math. I, I just misspoke. I just misspoke in that first one. Um, let me get up a YouTube video downloader so I can just rip this straight from the thing. 
do 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 I where you would have been not even 15. I would have been 18, I'm pretty certain. I was 18 when this happened. He's gay, he can't do math. True, true. Yes, no maths. Yeah. Okay, can I just download this directly? Straight into my downloads? I think so. I think that's worked. Or not. No, it has not. Drat. We've only got a little bit of time left. But we have to go on this tangent. We have to see the tangent through. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's because I downloaded audio. That would make that that would make sense as to why that did that. Do 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 do. Do do do. Could you also post this unlisted on your channel? Maybe, maybe. It technically has fire in it, and YouTube's not too fond of fire. Even unlisted fire. Hi Owen, hello. Did that save at all? Did that just not save? That's weird. Where did that not save to? Oh, it saved it to VODs. Whoops. <laughs> That's an hour VOD. <laughs> Copy and paste that back to my downloads. There. You're gonna see very young me here. And yet, I also don't look that different. <laughs> okay, if I do this. Wow, that slow motion goes crazy, bro. Those frames per second is wild. Were you 18? Yeah, yeah, very young. Why is it so slow? Does it speed up? Are you just trying to, oh, okay, there he is. Oh, it speeds up. Sick in the head. <laughs> it's a wolf. You can tell what kind of music I used to be into. Very good. Well, very flashy. <laughs> that was kind of cool. You can tell I was a big... This was like almost the beginning of my magic. The whole like doing that, taking the flame away, and then like snapping your fingers and it coming back. That, that snap is kind of cool. Hold on. Trigger into snap is crazy. Oh, I, you can tell I'm doing, I'm better with my right hand to click my fingers. So I'm using my left hand there to, usually I would trigger it with my right hand, but I clearly had to change it to do it oh, with my left. Oh, that's impossible. How did you do that? Oh, there you go. Yeah, there you go. Wait, can you really know how to do this? I do know how to do this. That quality is crunchy. That's fun. Wait, do that again. Oh, get in that. Dang, your first aerial. Oh, 
Oh, you can tell I was impressed with this one because I slowed it down. That's actually very technically difficult, I think. <laughs> I'm, I'm dunking on myself, but... Are you holding it from the... Oh. 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 Okay, no, fair enough. I can't do that. There you go. That's all of it. And then I think it's just the outro. Thanks for watching, I say. There you go. Yeah, I can't believe that's... Uh, can't believe that was... When I was 18, that's crazy. Uh, anyway. <laughs> uh, back to work. What was I doing? Oh yeah, going up. Forget everything I ever said. Why? What happened? What, what, everything you ever said? What about yes, when I asked you to marry me? What about that bit? <laughs> There's a zombie. Right now, and I still look the same. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. You've been cheeky now. I've been a little bit cheeky. But actually, though, what, forget what, forget everything you ever said about what. I said you're so cool. Oh, thanks. Wow. Today going live was worth it. <laughs> it was fun. It was a lot of fun to do. And you can definitely tell that I really enjoyed hobbies that were theatrical in nature. Like, let's call it for what it is, showboating. It's like, look what I can do. But I, at a young age, said to myself, I want to be able to be in a room and be able to draw an audience, to entertain, to do something interesting with every, any given item on the table. So I was like, okay, Rubik's Cube, done. If anybody has a Rubik's Cube, I can be like, oh, I can do that. And I was like, what else do people do? Everyone's constantly asking for a lighter. If I learn how to do cool tricks with a Zippo, then anytime anybody has a Zippo out in public, I can be like, oh, do you need something cool? <laughs> kind of thing, you know? And then it was clearly, a deck of cards. That was like the most standard thing. Oh, that's sick, Luan. Luan's giving me concept art for my rat. He looks great. Oh, I love the I love the details. That's so cool. He's cool. No more boy loser. No more boy loser rat. Time for cool Owen rat. Oh, and I have some. You have some? Can we see? No. So sad you won't show. Sorry. You're going to have to look at the reflection of my eyes. You'll have to watch the series. How much fur do we have? Dang, we got a while. I hate when it puts us that blow. That's annoying. New to pair with. Oh, sick. That's going to break that portal down there, isn't it? Oh, this will be... Oh, this is going to be so cosplayable. The rat... That we're going to have a field day. i got to get to it before it gets rid of the thing. I can see the blocks and it's... No! It broke the portal. Wait, no, it's still going. I can still make it. No! Oh, now it broke the portal. Unless it stopped just before. Did it stop just before? Never mind, it stopped just before. That's crazy. I guess water has to be placed inside of it. Same rat, new rat, completely different rat. This guy ain't even gonna know of rat Owen. What else? Things like paper clips and a bill. Like if you gave me like two rubber bands and a, and a five pound note, I could do like a trick with that. That was magic related. A lot of magic was around like, okay, if you give me a, a bottle cap and a, and, a, and a glass, maybe I can do something with that. Like that kind of thing. Okay, let's block this off. And then use this. Juggling, yeah. If you gave me three things, 
I could probably juggle depending on the weight of them. Those vids were so cool. Yeah, unfortunately. A lot of them kind of like either compromised on my identity or just aren't, don't really hold up well. But no, I do love rats. Good, I'm back. Rats are great. Tricks of Bruno and Tang. Do, 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 do. Oops, did not mean to save a screenshot, but now I have. Man, I didn't think that the nether roof bit would take this long. I thought this was going to be a relatively quick bit of it all. Because you genuinely just enjoy entertaining people to prove you can stuff or attention. If we're going to call it what it is, if we're going to be honest about it, it's probably attention. It was probably I was the youngest child and I wanted, it was like a vibe for attention kind of thing. Because like, how else am I going to get attention if not do things that people find impressive yeah which i think like on one hand is if we're gonna take it in a negative light you could be like okay so you're trying to show off which you know fair enough that would be what it is i guess i think you could also title it as like i'm trying to be entertaining i like entertaining people it's why i got into acting it's why i like streaming so much so i guess i just really liked that I liked entertaining. Okay. Now we want to break this and get rid of these guys. Of course, we had to come up in the middle of an ocean. That was That's just how it is. That's just how it works. Get a bit of light in here. Uh, let's get rid of this bit, actually, for now. Okay, boop. Let's do this. I thought you'd like it. You were wrong. Get rid of it. I don't like it. Wouldn't it be cool? I mean, cool if it wasn't so harrowing. But wouldn't it be cool to be able to walk the ocean floor without the water there? Like, I don't mean like, oh, you know, it's all dried up kind of thing. I just mean like... If you could do it for, a, like, just remove it for, you could pause time, remove it, and then put it back after you're done walking. I want to walk around the coral reefs. I want to rappel down the Mariana Trench. Man, it would just be so sick. <laughs> Get them sponges out. <laughs> when I saw a photo once of what the ocean looks like without the blue hue... Someone, like, took photos of the coral reef and then got rid, like, used color correction to make it as if there wasn't any uh, water there. As if, like, what would it, what would the hue look like if it was above ground? Uh, incredible. It was, like, breathtaking. I was like, this is so detailed and so colorful. It was awesome. Okay, there we go. That gives us a little out there. Someone please grab these cords. Three, 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 two, one, two. Okay. Homeward bound is north. Let's go. Why I thought the characters were mouse instead of It's because my nickname was Missy Mouse. I see, I see. No, no, no. The fish wouldn't be floating in the air. There wouldn't be any wildlife. I think it would be a bit odd to be able to. No boat. I've got depth strider, so I'm actually about as fast as a boat. Okay. I imagine it didn't put the portal on the surface because uh, it couldn't because of the ocean. That one Doctor Who special, that would be kind of cool, I guess. Right, now, in our last 10 minutes or so, we're going to go over to... Ah, oh, we need looting. We need looting on the sword. That, that's what we'll do next time. We'll do looting on the sword, and we will um, go and get three wither skulls. Now we have a way to the nether roof. We have a portal that goes back there, so we can do that. 
but we do need looting on the sword. We might be able to roll it a little bit. We might as well like keep doing this until we get it. Sharpness is good, but it ain't as good as it could be. Yeah, we've got to defeat the wither so we can get a beacon so that we can then uh, instamine stone, which means we can then terraform the land. There's method to all of this. There is a reason why we're doing this. Just realized I didn't have a respiration on that entire time. How silly of me. When do you have to go again? In about 10 minutes. Thank you, Bunny, for the uh, for the follow. Oh, hello. Come back. Um, you're going to be stuffed from the P.O. box. Uh, Monday. So you might not be able to get anything there in time, but... Uh, we'll get, you'll get me on the next one. Okay, what do I want to do? I want to get books. Books, please. Oh, I have books in my inventory. Uh, I don't know when the PO box will close. I'll have to check. So we do this. Check for looting. We don't get it. We do this. We check. Excuse me. Sharpness, no. No. Looting. Sick. We've got our objective. We have our heading. Here we go. I'm actually being too useful. Sometimes I just feel like I'm just here. It gives me a purpose. I'm glad. Do 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 so we need 30 levels. We can get a couple from here, I think. The stuff that's already on route to the PO box when it's closed gets sent back. I could not tell you, but I'll give you a warning when it's going to close. And maybe I'll extend it by a month or so in case there's like something out there that needs to be done. I mean, if you want, I can check real quick. Hold on. It shouldn't take too long. I might as well just do it now. P.O. box. Do, 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 do. Actually, I have a card in my wallet for this. I've got my days, man. I've done the last one. I don't have my card. My life is amazing. Oh, there it is. Date stamp 25th of June. July, August, September. Okay. Fine. So you got time. Because I'll definitely be done by then, everything. Uh, there's some... What was his... Uh, Sleeping wants me to see the 3D printed stuff, but I want I can I can just go and get more if you say it's it's arrived. 25th of September is when it will close, but you should get things there before. Obviously. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, I got 22 levels there. Um, no, let's not push it. Let's not let's not overextend ourselves. Mm, mm, mm. Actually, we've got a little bit of stuff here. We can mine this in the meantime. Basically, I need to go nether quartz mining again in order to get um, 30 levels. Because until we find a spawner, there's not much else we can do. Once we've done that, we'll enchant the sword. We'll get looting. Then we'll go to the nether where there's the wither, the wither skeletons. And we'll try and get three skulls. Then we'll go to the nether roof. We'll kill the wither. Um, and we'll get ourselves an insta-mining beacon. Thank you very much for the raid! A yo-yo donut. I'm laughing because my Twitch username is mispronounced. The rest is usually in your include my use, which I haven't played in a long because I'm planning on moving out of my parents. Oh, cool. Welcome in, raiders. You, you saw the quarters on the tail end. I've got to dash off for something interesting and fun and cool about a project that I can't talk about. It's a meeting of sorts. 
Do -do -do. Next time you'll see me will be Monday, chat. Okay, we're actually doing pretty good. We've got 25 levels. Sick. Oh, look at all the sheep. <laughs> That's funny. I forget how many. I, I think it's two stacks and 16 or something to get like a full beacon. But you can't do it with copper, can you? So it's got to be iron. Ugh, that's going to be long. Iron farm probably will be the next step. But to get the iron farm, I need to do a building. And to do a building, I need to do the tower forming. So it's cyclical. How do we get out of this? How do we do this? Grab that. I know that I have some iron. There it is. Do, 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 do. Chain together. The game. Do. I think we've done a really good job today, everyone. Well done. Let's call it there. Do -do. Let's raid into somebody. Do, do, do. 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 Okay, we're going to raid into Water Bunch. Thank you very much for joining me. It was a pleasure to see all of you as usual. Water Munch's PNG has got dyed hair. What's going on with that? I will see you all... Um, when? To, on Monday. I'll see you all on Monday. I just joined. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. If you want more content, you can check out my VODs channel. Or you can just go to the Discord where people will be hanging out. Probably right now. <gasps> wow. I'm also going to go post my uh, question of the week. So please go to the Discord and answer my question of the week. I've already now thought of the question I'm going to do. Isn't that nice? All right, cool. I'll see you all soon. Bye, 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 bye. Thanks for joining. Bye, 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 bye.